Hello YouTube, how's it going? I would like to um, give you a tutorial on how to download Project 64 1.6 and Project 64K. What you're going to want to do is go to the link that I'm going to provide in the description. Um, that's my own personal link. I have it in a .ir file. You're going to have to download WinRIR Win if you want to use the file. So just give me a moment to find it here. Sorry I don't have it open. Um, how odd. Sorry about, sorry YouTube. Just give me a, just give me a moment trying to find it. There it is. So, what you're going to want to do when you're in the, when you get the, when you get to the download link, you're going to want to, you're going to, you're going to want to, damn it. So, I'm so sorry, YouTube. This is my first tutorial video. So what you're going to want to do is open, not save. You're going to want to open the file. And once you get that file open, you're, what you're going to want to do is extract this folder over to your prop, to your, um, to your C drive and your program files. I'm not going to extract it there because I've already got it there. But once you extract it to your C drive, here's what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to click on your local disk, go to program files, find project 64 1.6, and you can either run project 64 or project 64K. You're going to have to download your ROMs from a web from any ROM website. I'm going to provide a link to the one that I use in the video description. But I've already ha I already have some ROMs here, so I'm just going to drag it to the file. Which you're going what be if you want to start playing the ROM, here's what you have to do. I'm just going to start project 64. Give me a moment, just need to check my controls. Okay, everything's okay. What you're going to want to do is go to file and choose ROM folder and then find the folder where you have all your ROMs. So that way it will appear like this. Um, okay then, so if you want to start up a ROM, what you need to do is just click on one and start it up. I'm just going to start Glo Glover here. says emulation started but I don't see anything here oh. emulation advanced well whatever well you would have s oh there it is so yeah you, you, you can just start up your game normally and play just like on like as if you were playing a normal Nintendo that's in project 64 also this is project 64k which is the one that I always use the difference between this one and project 64 is the other there's the ability oh no okay sorry I closed it the difference between this one and project 64 is the ability to start netplay what netplay is it's just any other it's just a normal I mean it lets you play it lets you play your Nintendo ROMs online against others so I'm just going to try and find a quick game here. Join this guy. And you see it's going to open up it's going to open your it's going to open a window and you can voice chat here. I'm going to put recording for YouTube to tour real. It's just and it's normal. I have no idea what this guy is doing. Um, if you're the second person, then you won't have any control over this. So, so just let the person start up. I'm I'm playing Super Smash Brothers, but and show me your noob skills. Oh. So you have voice chat. It'll start up right here. I'm not so experienced with this, so just give me a moment. I'm just gonna exit out of here. You can oh, 
so that's basically about it okay so thank you for watching this tutorial and have a good day